Hey, Kurt Jackson, Retirement Income Strategist with KJ Financial in Liberty, Missouri, where we help make sure that the little financial things don't sneak up and become big financial things that to derail or ruin your retirement. All the while, we are still helping you safely increase your lifelong, ever-increasing net spendable retirement income up to $2,560 a month or more. Right? Okay, let me ask you this. Do you think benefits such maybe as Social Security, Medicare, Medicaid, do you think that there's any possibility with all the money that the government's promised and spending might be lower in the future? Could we see lower inflation adjustments for Social Security? I mean, aren't they already talking about that? Could you see higher deductibles on Medicare benefits? Aren't they already starting to do that? Maybe even see higher premiums and more out-of-pocket costs for Medicare? Aren't we already kind of seeing that? Could the government decide that lower, you know, even lower retirement incomes should be taxed more? Right? Isn't that a real threat? Now, would that mean, what would that mean to you and your family? Would that mean that you might have to have a lower standard of living in retirement? Are you okay with all of that? What is your strategy to cope with that, to overcome that, to allow for that? If there were strategies out there to make sure that if those benefits re were reduced, you would still have enough income to make sure that your standard of living did not go down, wouldn't you want to know about them? See, there are many great strategies out there to help protect you from all of these possibilities. Or maybe should we call them probabilities. Now, if, if this is the first that you're hearing of them, or did your advisor talk to you about them and you decided they weren't for you? So, huh? Is it the first time you've heard about them, or maybe your advisor talked to you about them and, and you decided they weren't for you? If that's the case, I'd be surprised. But I guess if, if you haven't heard about them, you probably ought to ask yourself why. Why hasn't my advisor shared them with me? Why hasn't my plan administrator at my retirement plan at work shared these with me? Uh, so that's a question for you, you between you and them. But if you if you've decided that you would like to explore the strategy, so you can make sure that you don't have to suffer a lower standard of income if these things were to happen, then you feel free to call me directly on my cell phone. My direct line is eight one six five eight two five five three two, or you can click on the form below the video. Uh, that'll be forwarded to us if you happen to be on a video, watching a video on YouTube, and there's no form, then you can email directly Curry at kjfinancialonline.com. Uh, and just say, uh, I don't want to have my uh, standard of living lowered in retirement. We'll know what you're talking about. Put that in the subject line. So I, I would ask a favor of you if you think that this information here is valuable and some of your friends, family, coworkers might find some value in it. If you'd forward the link to them, I would certainly appreciate it. I bet you they would too. So thank you for stopping by. And, I, and even if we don't talk, I truly hope that your retirement is all that you want it to be. I uh, hope you have a successful one, and I also hope you have a great day. Thanks for tuning in.